وسلم in which it's recommended for us that we recite ayat al-kursi before we sleep in the hadith if you're about to go to sleep then read ayat al-kursi from the beginning to the end if you read this ayah then Allah Azza wa Jal appoints for you a guardian from the angels that protects you the entire night and a shaytan will not approach you he will not come near you subhanallah until the morning and I wanted to share with you the relationship between Ayat al-Kursi and sleep, subhanAllah. Uh, very quickly, you realize at the beginning of this ayah, when you read Allah, la ilaha illa huwa al al qayyum there are only a couple of ayat that begin with the name Allah. And these are great, such powerful ayat. In fact, Ayat al-Kursi is the greatest ayah in the Quran. When you read Allahu la ilaha illa hu, this is describing Allah. And, and consider you're sleeping now and you're declaring a tawheed just before you sleep. Because who knows, you might not wake up from your sleep. You say Allahu la ilaha illa 